Um, there's rat beef going on right now. I don't know if you care about that. Um, streamer beef. Tell me all about the rat beef. I super, I, I super duper care. I super care. Let's go. Um, well, okay. You're not really going to care. I don't really care. Can I just tell you what I've been on? What do you mean I'm not going to care? I just said I super duper care. You call me a liar. Okay. I said I super duper care. Okay. Met Metro, Metro Boomin and Future dropped an album. Uh, oh. Whoa. Okay. And uh, Kendrick hopped on the track. Shit. Um, and they're basically coming at like Drake and J. Cole and... Um, it's like rap shifting right now, so we've got to see what's about to happen. Yeah, yeah, wow. And, Whoa. And then, oh, and then, wow. and then Diddy just got caught trafficking girls, and pe and pe he's a pedophile. You know, <laughs> how many unique positions to comment on this, John? <laughs> it's, it's kind of funny, you know, let me tell you something, Aiden. Something else, some more life advice for you. Being a horny will get you in trouble in general let's forget diddy in his case and whatever it goes in court of law innocent guilty that's up for him he's gonna work it all out but in general if you're one of them horny you know those dudes on instagram those indians saying boobs vagina all day <laughs> yeah. if, you're, if your whole life is just being horny you're gonna be in trouble whether you're satisfied or not yeah whether you get the girls or not because if you have too many girls you got stress too much, you're going to end up in jail for some reason or some kind of claims that have come against you. Or you're sitting at home all day jerking off, wasting your life. You need to just give up that horniness crap. You know, I've come to the conclusion that having sex with loads and loads of girls is pretty gay. You should have sex to make children, because children are important. But if you just want to have sex with girls, just put your little pee-pee in and out. And then finish and go, yay, I had sex. You're pretty gay. That's gay. How is that gay? I would never have sex without the possibility of there being a child made. Because Wait, so you, you wait, you stick that Romanian penis in a girl and you're expecting to, to come inside of her every time and create life? Firstly, firstly I am not Romanian. <laughs> wait, I know, but what I'm but okay. So you you think every time Apo you apologize. I'm sorry. For missing Analyzing me. I'm, I hate That's that. Right. Are you are you cloned? Why do you care now? Are you soft now? Why do you care? I want to be factually correct on this stream. Fine. I'm sorry for the miss point here is being horny, and I know I'm telling you this because I know you jerk off probably like 18 times a day, little weirdo. <laughs> you need to get rid of that horny crap. Instead, train hard, worship God, make money, make some kids, and just calm down. If everybody would calm down, none of this would happen. But everyone's like, oh, I'm horny. I need to f six f girls, two dudes. Like, just Everyone just needs to chill. Two dudes? As an example of what you're up to. I'm not a guy. Okay, anyways, whatever. I agree. Tell me more about this rat beef. Um, so, yeah, that's going I, The whole diss shit's going on right now. We're waiting for diss tracks coming in and out. Um, but the, the Diddy is what's big too like it's crazy as fuck. he got his house raided um for sex trafficking um, been there <laughs> and then do you live near him what do you live near him i don't know honestly i i think he like got his la raided but did he was doing weird shit. but he fled he fled he fled the country like he left and he's he went to a, a private island or something like that did you tell everyone about it on your stream? Did, okay, was it really my stream that got you locked back up? No. Oh it God. wasn't. However, however, that stream did go super viral. And let me explain how the world works, but especially how Romania works. Nobody really wants to have the... So when that stream went viral, there's obviously my PO and, and the judge and a lot of people involved in my case who started to panic. And they're like, oh, this is going to be very bad for me if he does run away, which I'm never going to do because I'm innocent. Especially as everybody knows he said he's going to run away. This is going to end up on my plate. 
So they all panicked and increased my surveillance and started following me in unmarked cars and all this kind of garbage because of your post. That happened. But I don't care. They followed, they've been following me around anyway, but that's the kind of thing that happened because of you. Because for some reason, I don't know why that one clip went mega viral, but it did. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, yeah, that was up. I'll tell you what, though. Um, how would you like to, once you're considered free, because all these girls are finally like taken back what they're saying about you. So once you finally get freed, uh, how about we? Uh, I take you out to some dinner. On me. What girls? What girls? I thought I thought I saw something like. Oh, oh no, bro! They never said anything about me in the first place. That's what I'm saying. Oh really? So then, what, what were they? What was the statements that were being said, or something like that? So you're saying that the girls have now changed their minds and are re removing themselves from the case. That's good, right? They, no, no, they they haven't changed their minds. They never said anything bad about me and never wanted to be in a case. Wow. From the beginning. The state made the case with girls screaming saying I'm innocent, me screaming saying I'm innocent, everyone saying I'm innocent. The state made the case. And only now, after two years, does the judge give them the chance to leave the case. That's so wrong. Bro, it's a matrix attack. It's a matrix attack. And they're doing it to me because I was ma massively influential and they were scared of, of the influence I had. Well, so they tried to well, you, well, well you, you, you literally are part of the reason why this new generation clip farming is a thing, right? Like clippers and clip farming. You probably don't know what that means, but you are probably one of the biggest to do it. So they banned you on TikTok. They basically banned you everywhere except for X now, which is amazing. Shout out to Elon. Um, by the way, do you know Elon? But I an instrumental in the breaking of the matrix if you actually time my cancellation if you time me getting deleted on instagram that's exactly when people's consciousness start to awaken and understand that we're being lied to on every single level if i had to mar my social media accounts to awaken the next generation to the satanic rituals which they're living under then it's completely worth it so i actually have been massive for damaging the matrix me alone as one man along with others of course i've been i've been monumental for this movement yeah, I agree. Um, so it's worth. No, it is. Uh, wait, what did you? What do you think about the whole Ryan Garcia? What's been going on with Ryan? I love Ryan, and I hope the best for him in all realms. Uh, he he says some things which are controversial and outlandish, but in the world today, it's really not so far fetched. My only concern is I think he should focus on his upcoming fight because he's got a, a difficult one, and he's no walkover. I said the I same. I said the same exact thing, and people were saying that I'm. Wor I work for them. I literally said the same thing you just said. Yeah, but you can't be trusted, though. I'm sorry. I'm Chuck G. I don't sell my soul. I don't end up on lean. I'm not some dickhead in Miami jerking off. I'm not like you. I'm built different. You, when you say it is kind of like, mm, who paid him? He'll do anything for a buck. 